because I wanted a fun, fast-paced, uh, unpredictable internship where I was going to be learning new things every day, um, kind of learn new experiences, be challenged, uh, and you know, kind of be tested as I go throughout the summer, and that's what Bailey provided. And when I found Bailey, I, uh, I really liked what I saw and what I researched about them with the international side uh, and exporting and domestic part of the business. And so when I was offered the opportunity, I, I took it up. A little bit about the internship. I knew it involved um, some travel, some projects. I knew at the end there would be a presentation um, in front of like the president of the company. So that I knew, I thought that was going to be cool. And then also, I didn't know anything about Harvard Lumber, um, so I had had no expectations for, for Harvard Lumber or the industry or the market and anything like that. So that was all new, new to learn. I was really excited, um, but as I left, you know, I gained so much knowledge um, about business in general and uh, different markets around the world and in the U.S. and just kind of different business practices that I had no clue of before. I really had no expectations. I knew uh, basically that it was a lumber business and I didn't know how large it was. I knew it was international, so I knew it had to have some volume to it. Uh, but I really had no expectations for what I'd be doing. You, know, you learn about the product from the first step all the way through until it's a finished product that, you know, the sales, the sales end you know what they're working with. So I really enjoyed being able to see all the steps that, you know, a tree goes through from, or lumber goes through from a tree to an actual board. Uh, I think probably one of my favorite parts was traveling with the traders, um, you know, meeting people from all around the world, uh, all around the United States, getting to kind of connect and relate to different people uh, from different cultures, and it was really interesting to kind of hang out with these guys for days at a time, uh, you know, stay in hotels and just travel around. Uh, I really loved the traveling aspects, uh, right from the bat, I and mean, I was traveling uh, on my own to a couple different uh, mills and then also with some buyers and traders and I really enjoyed all of the traveling involved. So my training started by going, uh, I started uh, you know with a forester in the woods then went to the mill, you know, after the trees had cut down, they go to the mill, I watched that whole process, and then went to the yard, learned about the drying process, and these are all different locations that I'm traveling around to. Um, and there's different products in every different area, so I would start by, you know, being out in central New York, then go to Ohio, then Pennsylvania, then Wisconsin, and we went down to see, you know, the facility in Kentucky, and it was, I mean, it was great kind of learning about the product and being able to actually see every step of the way um, and how it differs location to location. For my training, I spent a lot of time at the sawmills, uh, the lumber yards, just kind of learning about the whole practice. Um, you know, where lumber comes from, how it becomes, or how it goes to the uh, end user. And then I spent a lot of time with the traders, kind of meeting with customers, driving around, buying and selling lumber uh, to different customers in America and throughout the world. I learned that I like learning. Um, it's, it's been awesome to just every day come to work and be learning more. There's always more to, to know, to know about the industry, the market, about sales. I also learned that I'm, I'm quite young, that you know, being 21 years old, um, you know, most people that I'm riding with, talking to, they've been around for you know, 20, 30 years, which I think is a testament to Bailey and the culture and the people that like working at Bailey, but also makes me feel quite young. I learned that I pretty much know nothing about business. Uh, everything that you think you know in school, um, you think you could go into a company and work right away, but you have no clue. Um, so I, I learned, and I was very humbled by that, uh, the fact that I don't know as much as I think that I do. Um, and I think that's probably the same for a lot of college kids. You know, I had no idea the size of the company. Um, 
you know, it's from Hamburg, kind of my backyard, and it turns out that, you know, it is, has its kind of hand in every region of the world. Uh, you know, we're working with China on my project, and, you know, I'll look into banks in the Middle East and where the, how the lumber gets over there, or Europe, or wherever it is. It's really, you know, it was exciting to see how, how large Bailey was. The Bailey Lumber is one of the most unique companies that I've ever viewed. Um, you know, from the people to the entire culture of the company, it's very relationship oriented. The industry itself is very unique. Um, and it's really cool just to see how everyone's so well connected and how, you know, an agent from Bailey might be really good friends with one of his customers. That You don't see that in any other industry, especially with very large companies. Um, that was the one thing that surprised me is how just relationship oriented it is. Uh, and that kind of drives the business and, and that's a really cool thing. Some of the most challenging aspects of the internship was um, trying to be, trying to aggressively learn, ask good questions, intriguing questions, questions that people can expound on and explain. Um, because you're in front of a lot of people, you're interacting with a lot of people, um, and you want to learn, but how do you ask the question? How do you get them talking? My project, um, working to, you know, I was working with these Chinese uh, sales associates, and you know, they're on the ground in China, and I had to be able to communicate with them and say, you know, is this product over there? So it was kind of, it was tough, you know, trying to communicate with these people that are up at the complete opposite time of the day, and if you have a question, you have to wait for the night. Two things that surprised me the most were how helpful and passionate people were. So if you ask them a question, they wanted to help, they wanted to explain, they wanted to tell you. And then the other thing that I was surprised is how much I wasn't bored. Throughout the whole time I was engaged, uh, they had me doing a lot of different things and it just wasn't a boring thing, which I think is the most important thing when you do, do an internship or a job is to be engaged. You know, the commitment to the betterment of the company, everyone's working towards, you know, what can we do to make this company succeed? You know, how are we going to get the, you know, best deal we can on this sale? Or, you know, how can I help you succeed as a You know, you have a hardwood table here, well, where did the wood come from? The entire process that goes into that is very, very complicated. It's very, um, you know, there's a lot of hands that go into it and a lot of, time and effort and money that's put into every single piece of wood that you see in front of you. And I think that's the part that surprised me the most is, you know, you see a wooden door and that's awesome, but you have no clue where it came from or where, like, what the entire uh, piece of lumber story is. I would highly recommend this internship because I don't think there's another internship out there that would be able to provide you with the experience to actually see what it's like to have the job as one of these traders or salesmen at the company. Um, but if there's also a lot that you have to do. You have to be able to adapt well, you have to travel and things like that. I would recommend this internship for other college kids because if they want to have the most fun, interesting, um, unique experience out of everyone that they know, then this internship is for them. You know, you never know what you're going to be doing the next day. You're always traveling, you're always meeting new people. Uh, you know, you're not sitting behind a desk doing some mundane thing day in and day out. Everything's different. They give you a real, like a very challenging project that you have to work for that actually provides value for the company and that's cool to be a part of in itself. Um, and you just get to relate to people. Uh, you get to spend time with just about everybody in the company. And that's something that you don't really get to do in other internships. It's, it's by far the coolest internship I've ever heard of.